It was incredible. The whole process of making this movie was fantastic. I'm I mostly do comedy, and just to be trusted with Marva um, was a, such a blessing. It is a blessing to me. Thank you. And uh, it just it felt so good to have. I felt like the whole crew, the whole cast, everybody who was on set. Um, there was a synergy. We all knew what story we were trying to tell, and I felt really good. I felt really good. Uh, no, being from Jamaica and, and reading the script and knowing that uh, Suds and Jen was uh, behind this, uh, I, uh, I felt I needed to be a part of this, and I was going to be a part of this in whichever way, and I was going to, you know, uh, fight somebody to be a part of this. And uh, I just felt they had something to offer, and I know that Jen and, and and, and, and such, they, they do good work and they put a lot of heart and soul into their work. So working with them was, was easy because that's my mentality when I do anything is to put 100%. And we worked on Guns together, if you all remember Guns, which was a great... Um, and you weren't to expect that anyone could come slack. I think I'm one of the two persons who actually still live permanently <laughs> in Jamaica. I'm Kadima. Kareem Wilson, the Don, the other Don. Yeah. <laughs> the uh, small you saw, Don, I'm you saw, afraid of. Yeah, <laughs> Don, he's afraid of. Even he's afraid of. You know, both live there. And when I saw Pasta Pasta on the scenes, I had to pitch myself because I was like, how are we going to recreate those scenes? And I, you know, I go through those communities. I live in communities like that. And it was realistic. So I think back home when that debuts, Things like the Rastafari and Faith. I grew up with a Rastafari and uncle, even though I'm not one. But we had to be very respectful and authentic as much as we could, and I think we achieved that very much, both visually and spiritually. So it's been a great pleasure. Thank you. I love all of you. I love you, Sus and Jen, for giving me this opportunity. Uh, we go way back. Um, I want to say thank you to you two, just from me personally, because uh, funny enough, this is a little personal between them and I, but they believed in me when nobody else did and have given me an opportunity to continue working, so I love you guys for that. Thank you so much for my heart. Yeah, oh, thank you so much. <laughs> um, I want to thank Suds and Jennifer for giving me this opportunity. This is amazing. I couldn't have asked for anything uh, bigger for me at this point in my career. I'm so honored, so blessed. In terms of working in Trinidad, um, so much fun. I miss the people a lot. Uh, when I came back, I was bumping so for like two months straight. Um, <laughs> So, you know, even though my mom's Jamaican, she probably hates me for saying that, but, you know, it, it, it was fun, it was fun. The whole experience was fun. I'm incredibly honored, incredibly blessed to work with such amazing people on a daily basis. Thank you so much for joining in and being here with us to share in, in this moment with us. Thank you so much. A wonderful pleasure for me because I am truly interested in delving into the Caribbean story and it was wonderful to have Suds call up and deliver this script right in the right kind of time that I could fit it in and share um, one of the thousands upon thousands of amazing stories from great writers from this region of the world um, and of course I'm from Guyana. <laughs> Congratulations, guys. Thanks for the movie. Thanks for coming. <laughs>